Well, if you uh, watched the first video, I don't think this is going to be much better. So now we're in open setups. I believe cautions are on, and uh, we got 70 laps to be bad. I went on the forums, and, uh, well, nothing really gave me speed on there. That I, you know, the ones that I found were older, but I don't think that's the problem, especially when we got our butts kicked when it came to fixed setup racing. So, yeah, we're just, uh, we're in trouble. We're in a lot of trouble, and, uh, that's fine. We can be a back marker and just, I don't know, try, try to get what we can. Um, I'm looking to see if there's any new... No, there's no new setups. So, uh, I don't even have a paint for this car. We're just green and black in this one. It's, uh... Yeah, this is the setup I'm going with. We've got 5.3 gallons. It's kind of loose, but kind of tight. And I don't know what to do to go faster. So, I did go one click up on the rear wing. And, uh, I mean, we're just, we're in trouble. Good news is we're not number one, so that's a positive. I think we just at the uh, start of this one. I think we just start in the back, especially with the yellows, and try to figure out something. It's got to be a, a lot of my driving, and maybe the i racing setup is just the way to go because that's the fastest laps that I've done. But try to get a lap in here and see how we compare. Try to get a lap in here. This is way too tight on exit there. 19-2. And a 19-2 is going to put us dead last. Now, people might be dropping fuel for qualifying. And that's what they're running there, but, yeah, I, I need it looser on exit. I think we're going to go back to that, but then go with that. And I want... Can't go any further on that, so never mind. Guess let's go one click there. I don't know. Let's go figure out what this does. Oh, that's already. Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to struggle, but hopefully not get caught up in a wreck. And hopefully there's just no cautions because that would be boring. some of that out, but do we want to dial that out? Because that was kind of our issue in the USF 2000. Feels 
looks like we got a little more turn on exit. Do I shift? Or do I just peg it? Flag. No, we definitely shift. We're just... It's overall too tight. I mean, we're nearly at the max on downforce. Do we just max it out to make our uh, corners better? We go up, hold on, let's, let's just look at this arrow balance 41.8. Cause I don't want to unbalance this. Oh wait, we can't go up that much. I thought there was more. Well, we will just go 41.5, 41.8. Is that the same? Okay, it's the same. Hmm. Yeah, let's just let's just not not play with it. We'll go heavier on the front end. Hopefully, help me turn, but not completely spin us. And we are waiting on one guy who. No, we're waiting on two people. Uh, Wes is up there. He had fastest lap in the USF. And uh, he's going to go pull for this one. It looks like these two uh, guys did their lap and then have decided that we're going to sit here and wait. So, fun stuff. Probably the same set that I've already got in. Uh, that would be hilarious. Let's uh, see what this does. 42.3 arrow balance. We're going to have to learn everything here. But we know that it should be somewhat up here. Is the fuel all right on this? Sorry if this is secret. Five gallons. Yeah, that's what I figured. Let's, you know what, let's just be safe because that's not gonna, it's not gonna help at all. Not me. Line up on the I'm sure we're going to get closed. yellows, Pit but there's just no need for me to underfuel when we could have a chance of no yellows and uh, not be in trouble. We do have unlimited sets of tires, so I think we'll be pitting for those every time, but first got to figure out how to drive this setup. If it's a very nose-heavy setup, which I think, what is it? It was a higher number, higher percent, but I don't, I think that was percent to rear. I don't know. This is not a smart decision to go into this with, uh, with no practice on that setup because I I am not good at these I can't adapt very well I mean I couldn't even figure out how to go faster with the fixed setup so we're gonna pull over we're gonna stay low on the start let everyone pass us 
figure this thing out and try try our hardest to not be terrible but it's kind of cool to have a big field of cars like this for some short track racing I mean, to me, this isn't short track racing because these cars are so difficult to pass. And it's not like you can do a bump and run. Um, corner speeds are so quick. One left to green. But it's still, you know, I'm at the end of the season, week Get 11, two, trying two. to not be bored. Like dirt, every time I look at it, I'm like, oh, I don't really want to run that. But hopefully, we get a couple of laps to feel this thing out before a yellow. About to go green, stay focused. And uh, hopefully, the guy behind us doesn't just run straight into us because I'm going to stay right on the yellow line. And. Let him go. Car Clear up top. All right. Now we got some practice to do. Am I terrible or was the setups terrible? We got one in the wall. Let's hold it off. Well, the gearing, I think, is a little different. 27.6. Eh, it might not be. It's a lot different. Gearing's the same. I'm just going really slow right now. Tenth slower. Big push. Big arrow push, I think. You know what? Well, I was going to say we're still green, but... And unfortunately, that is the guy that sent us the set. So we're going to just pop on in for some tires. I don't think there's any pit adjustments. Yeah, there's not. I'm gonna go ahead and go up half a pound on the right sides. We're gonna throw some new tires on because we're already at the back, so why not? Box in five, three, two, one, right here. Ninety eight, ninety nine. So I've already hurt Let the right go. front. Kind of want to get a half a lap in here. Looks like those guys have got damage that they gotta fix, and there's no fast repairs in this. They want you in single file. Catch up, 13 car. So I assume it's single file restarts. saving fuel now since we're good on it after this caution. Probably we're good on it before it. Mm 
Single file. Perfect. Yeah, I don't know. I am... I'm just not gelling with this. This is just a whole different type of short track racing, and it is... About to go green, stay focused. Definitely much harder for me to get a handle on, so... But we'll see. We'll see if we can work our way up at all. up high, he might have damage. Oh Just gonna take our time here. Thirteen almost had a meeting with the wall. Jumped on the brakes and we just wrecked the guy. Flag is out. Line up, single file. Pit road is closed right now. Catch up, 17 car. <sighs> That's pathetic. Should not have stomped on the brakes that hard. Catch up, 13 car. That was just bad. And the other set was doing the same thing, so. That was just driver, not not anything to do with me grabbing a setup that I hadn't ran. I just jumped on the brakes too hard and looks like our race is over. And I should never get in another open wheel car on an old Pit box in five, three, two, one. Right here. What do we got? Well, that's race over. <sighs> it's not a not a good day. It's dumb for me to even try this. Uh, let's go see what happened in the first wreck. You know what happened in the second wreck. That was uh, pretty terrible by me. So 17 just gets loose. Well, multiple people got loose there. 17 gets loose on exit, and as he's getting loose, Jason gets loose and into the wall. And then... I just lose it on corner entry. And then we take the 17 out. Um, yeah, that is about as bad as you can be. <laughs> very, very, very poor performance here at USA for me. So we've got five minutes. I mean. It's going to be pointless to go back out there. We're going to be a weapon, so... Sadly, that is the end of our open wheel racing at USA. Because I don't need to be on the track. Not if I can't even uh, drive into a corner without wrecking. So, uh, sorry for those two races. Because that was pretty bad. And, uh on to something that hopefully I am good at. Thanks for watching.